Hello, I'm David. Hi, I'm Julie. So now we're going to do the next quest book, Prophecy of Teller. Ooh. And I believe these came with the Mythic Tear uh, when you backed it on Hasbro Pulse. So this is going to be Julie's 45th quest. And between <laughs> the last time when we finished off uh, the Frozen Horror, we have acquired the Rogue Hero. And because this is a lot easier than the uh, previous quest books, we're going to try uh, Julie playing just two characters. I'm nervous. Well, she is powered up, except for the rogue. So here we got. Here is what Julie's going to be playing. She'll be playing with the barbarian Yay. and the rogue. And if you remember, at the end of Frozen Horror, she had a thousand gold for each person. So the druid is retired right now. Doesn't mean the druid won't join later. And what we bought for the rogue, what she bought was bracers mm -hmm. and a crossbow. That way, if it just does start getting harder, we can still bring in the, the dwarf and the wizard. And the dwarf and the wizard loaned the uh, rogue some additional items. Mm -hmm. So there are three skills that the rogue has, which we'll go over while we're playing. Uh, in the meantime, though, let me show you what these characters have. In this particular quest book, The Alchemist, you can buy potions of healings that heal two body points. And they cost 200 gold each. So each one has two of those. And it's not on a card, which is kind of irritating. Mm -hmm. uh, from, a, from a design standpoint, you put everything else on cards except that one. So Hasbro hopefully will fix that in the future. Also, the Barbarian uh, from the Frozen Horror quest book was able to buy, and it says Barbarian only right here, was able to buy an Icy Strength Potion, which gets does times two body points uh, damage in the next attack. So if Julia were to roll three damage, I would actually do six. And she also has Battle Rage Potion, which does times two attack dice per turn if monsters in line of sight. So this would be good in a in a boss room. As long as there's a monster in line of sight, the uh, Barbarian will get uh, six, depending if it's undead or not, will get six attack dice or four or eight attack dice. I don't lose them when I use it, right? You lose a potion, yeah. I do lose a potion. Yeah. Okay. So that's why it's expensive. Now the band, the bandolier, yeah. uh, comes with the rogue, and so the the rogue, like the uh, dwarf, the toolkit, can disarm traps. So no roll of a of a uh, black shield or white shield. It's not as good as the dwarf, though. The dwarf, mm. and you also have unlimited daggers. Now the uh, wizard loaned you her, uh, her armband of healing. Mm -hmm. And you have the fire ring that protects against two fire dread spells. The dwarf never got a chance to use that. Oh, okay. Because it disappears after two uses. Oh, I see. And you have a holy water, a rock skin scroll, <laughs> and the curd scroll, which you have uh, loaned from other characters. Now, the barbarian, it's required that a character does have the talisman of lore. And you had that from the first uh, quest book. Mm. But you still have that. But you also have the Amulet of North. This is why your health is 10 with two red circles there because if you lose the amulet you'll, you'll go back to eight. Oh, okay and remember you only have one die six movement because you're wearing the plate mail oh duck on it so although the rogue can roll two red dice yeah the barbarian can only roll one and you do have the rabbit boots now there is one thing that someone pointed out thankfully i was doing uh jumping traps wrong and i corrected it here on the cheat sheet so this is version 1.1 if you do succeed, you can continue moving. I had, I think I had your movement end. Mm -hmm. uh, and then if you do trip to trap, you end the turn. I was doing that right. Okay. And if you fail, you move into the space. Obviously, if you don't fail, you jump over it. And then I also added here, we could play with mercenaries. But I don't think you're going to want to. Okay. Uh, you must repurchase them between quests. So I added that oh, okay. there as well for those who are using the, che the cheat sheet. Okay. So let's take a look at what you're going to be doing. I'm going to read you... The story? The story. Okay. So the mentor yes. is distracted in his welcome as you enter the study. The wizard glances at you, nods slightly, then continues to stare deeply at the pages of the open book. His face is grim. Finally, mentor looks up with eyes still focused on a distant thought. See, so notice I read that a lot better because this, this is written uh, better. <laughs> <laughs> Apologies, my friends. The wizard slowly closes the large book and walks around the great oaken table to stand before you. I am troubled. The pages of Lore Tomb do not reveal everything to me. The texts and symbols always shift, shimmer, and move as 
Future possibilities ripple with each passing moment, but not today. Today is different. The pages are like liquid. The words and symbols are like formless ink that swirls slowly within the pages. If I focus all my power, it takes shape for a moment. There is but one word, one name, Melar. As you may recall, you recovered Melar's talisman of lore from the heart of his maze some time ago. That was in the first quest book. Okay. What I did not tell you at the time was that Melar was exploring with magic behind his, beyond his own and researching something. I know not what. But before I could speak with him, he vanished. The maze and tower fell to ruin and were abandoned. When I discovered a scroll that spoke of the talisman, I summoned you to retrieve it. But there but must be something else, something I have overlooked. Dread magic is at play here, for the pages of Laura Tomb have never been so affected. I must explore this further. You, my friends, must return to Melor's maze. There you must explore all that remain of the library, search the laboratory once more, and delve into the tower of on the cliffs of Turek Tor. So you're going to go into the maze, search his library and laboratory, and then go into the tower. To the tower. Okay, okay they're all together. So to pretty get, much I'm searching for the tower. The, the tower is there. You've got to go through the maze to get into the tower. You're gotcha. trying to figure out what's going on okay. with his wise lore tomb, his book. It's like his scrying, like a crystal ball in a sense, but oh, it's a book. Okay is is uh, acting the way it is. Okay. I will guide you as best I can, but the pages of Laura Tomb in, in turmoil, my help will be limited. When I can, I will use my far voice spell and speak with you directly at key points along your journey. Hurry, my trusted heroes, hurry! For without Laura Tomb's read into the future, the realm is in peril and the forces of Zargon move unseen. So that's the introduction to this quest okay. book and there's 13 quests. All right, so return to Melar's Maze, quest one. Mentor speaks to you with the far voice spell. Much time has passed since you were last here. All may not be as you remember. You discovered the talisman of lore, but there is something else th that we have missed. Melar was researching something before disappearing. I have seen some of his cryptic notes. Melar obviously wanted the experiment to be kept secret. You must search the library. Perhaps there you may find more clues on the research being done. In clues to what happened to Melar. Uh, I think you went through it in the first. Quest. I don't remember. I've done so I mean, many the first of these. I, I don't, don't remember. remember. Okay, so here we are. Oops. Where are my little? Where do my ladies go? They're gonna go right here. Okay, I'm gonna give them to you. Actually, you're not gonna go right there. No. No. I had that there by mistake. Oh, that's great. Instead, you're coming down the stairs. Oh, nice. Okay, so let me uh, go to the other. Okay. Actually, it's right here. Ah. Yeah, I gotta move the camera. So here we go. Wee. Wee. So that's where my ladies start. Yeah. And what am I looking for again? The library. Library. That means I have to search in the library, right? When you find it. When I find it. Okay. Okay, so here is the rogue. Now, one thing that the rogue can do, I might as well go over this now. Let me put the door here. Okay. Because some people are probably wondering, how does the, the rogue work? I'm going to show you on the three cards. Mm -hmm. So you have the bandolier, which is the toolkit and, un, 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 and unlimited uh, daggers. Okay, so here's a really cool one right here. Opti these are skills that you have, these cards. And they don't go away, but they are limited to using once per turn. It says discard after use. It means they go away. It says do not. Oh. Okay, opportunistic striker. Once per turn, you may throw an extra combat die when attacking a monster next to another hero. So in other words, it's like a backstab okay. effect that you get in Dungeons and Dragons. So oh. so you can you have a short sword and a dagger. Mm -hmm. So you can add one attack die to the short sword or... Uh, one to the dagger? Or to the dagger, okay? Okay. Because here you have ambidextrous. Okay. Once per turn, when you attack with a short sword or dagger, you may make one additional attack with a dagger. Do not discard after use. So you're going to roll two dice for your short sword mm -hmm. and one die for your dagger. Oh, okay. Unless, of course, you're attacking a monster that's next to another hero, the Barbarian. And, would do two and, then you would, and then you would roll an extra die with your dagger. Okay. So, or, uh, so we'll get to that in a minute. I know that's confusing you. It's really confusing. Okay, so combat mobility. This is really important here. Remember how we always, always got bottlenecked? Yeah. You may move unseen through spaces occupied by monsters, 
So that means you can get behind them. Okay. So if it's in a hallway, you can get you can move through them. How many times do I get to do it though? It doesn't say. You can use it as much as you want. Oh, so all of those I can use as much as I want. Combat mobility as much as you want. All these you can use as much as you want, but the okay. ambidextrous and the opportunistic strike yeah. striker you could use once per turn, but you only attack once per turn anyway. True. Uh, True. Okay, because you can move through uh, characters anyway. Mm -hmm. We already know that. Yeah, I do know that. You, you have that movement. And so why don't you read your options again? Because it's been a. It's a been a weeks. minute, yeah. It's been a few weeks since we've played. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right, so now that you're in the room, let's get started here. So you're right here. Okay. What are you going to do? Are there any secret doors? No. Are there any traps? Any traps? Yeah. No. Um, okay, and I'm sure there's no treasure, so we're just going to go well, to the door. You could search and try to find potions and stuff. With my luck, there's going to be monsters. Okay, so you're there. The yeah. barbarian, I assume, is going first. Yep. Okay, you open the door. You don't see anything in the hallway until you step out. What are you going to do? Why don't you roll uh, one die for the barbarian? Because you can only roll one red die. Oh, one red die, not a blue die. Okay. Well, you move one. Yeah. Okay, you're out there. What do you do? What do, you do? Are there any traps? Uh, no. Okay, are there... Oh, well, there are monsters. Are there monsters? I would have put them out there. Are there secret doors? you got to have the rogue come out. Okay. The rogue moves, rolls. Two dice. Nine. You want to go to the left or to the right of the barbarian? Uh, let's go to the... this way. If you go here, you can see around the corner. Um, okay. Uh, actually, I need to put a door here. I forgot to do that. So you could go the other way if you yeah, want. Yeah, let's go the other way. Since there's a door, I, I want to go to the door. Okay, and it's blocked off here. Okay. It does go around the corner that way. Well, we'll think about it. Though. All right, so you step out. You've yeah. already asked for uh, traps. And uh, there's secret doors? Any secret doors? Yeah. Uh, no. All right, then. Uh, okay, then you can reset. You want to go to this door or go around the corner? Let's go to this door. Th this door. Oh, okay. Yeah. So you line up. Let me move this a little bit here. How do I get uh, rid of the plate mail so I can move faster again? Yeah, you'll have less defense dice if you do that. Oh, okay, I don't want to do that. Uh, you could buy it. You have plenty of money. Six, so you open the door. And for those of you who are wondering how this quest is going to go, it uses all the original monsters. It's there's, We're two quest books away from uh, using the dragon that came with the mythic tier. Ooh. All right, so there is a chest in here. Okay. Got to reach the other chest. That's what I will search. And there are two goblins. All right, well, we'll have to beat up the goblins first. This is why you're using two characters. This, I think this quest book, it seems like, would have been a good uh, a good one after the original, maybe. Well, All right. She's going to attack this guy. Okay, fire your crossbow. Three. Three attack dice. Good. Uh, you got him. Now you can have the. She's gonna rogue. use her crossbow to do. Well, you got to move in and fire. Can she see that guy? Wait, I no. did. You did the wrong guy. I told you to go for that guy, for uh, the barbarian. So then the rogue could do that guy. Well, so that was smart. Yeah, so go no. ahead. Go ahead. You can fire. Let me think. No. Yeah. Go okay. ahead. I'm not going to worry too much about line Ooh, only one hit. Doggone only it. one hit. Pooey. And because I want to show, I'm going to start showing the monsters on the board. Sure. Like I've done before. So this one has uh, one defense die. And I did not block it. See how easy that is? Okay. What do you do now? Okay. I'm going to roll for the barbarian. She's going to put a toe in. Yeah. Well, you only rolled a one. I know. I'm literally putting a toe in. So you are putting a toe in. What do you do? Traps? No. All right, I'm going to bring in my friend, and we're going to go check out the, the the treasure chest. Oh, hang on a second. I need to... I, I didn't read something. Okay. Okay. You're not stepping in yet. I didn't, I didn't set up the room correctly. What did I do wrong? 
The store's already open. You didn't do anything wrong. Oh. I did something wrong. I have to uh, set up this room, too, at the same time. That door's already open? Oh, mm -hmm. boogers. That means there's probably bad stuff in there. Uh, so I need to set it up. Okay. And I place all the monsters. So, yes, you did kill those, too, but yeah. there's, there's other monsters left. Oh, should be doobies. And they're going to come after us now. Yeah, but they're far away. Yeah, true. Because I'm not used to... I need to read the comments again. Let me make sure I have everything and read the comments. Okay. Okay. So I've set up both rooms. I put out all the doors. Okay. But these ones are closed, I see. Yes. Yeah. So now the goblin, so I have a goblin here. Mm hmm And a orc. Oh, okay. See, now it's your turn to go, yes. Right, I go, yeah. Or uh, The goblin can move ten. Oh, jeez. One, two, three, four, five, six. Attacks the barbarian with all these dice. I'm joking. Oh, my gosh. There's only two attack dice. Hit you twice. One, two, three. Three, four, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, let me make sure. Right? Yeah. Because I'm looking at the red up there. Right. Yeah. Because you get, uh, you start out with two. That's mm -hmm. your natural, and then you have uh, a bonus of five with all the armor you're wearing. Yeah, yeah. So that's why. Okay. So okay. Got, oh, babe, I'm sorry. No, you're right. I'm just, I'm in the way here. And I blocked both of them. Okay. <laughs> All right. One, two, wait, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Why didn't you move that guy? I killed him. You didn't kill him. I did. This is from this room. You blocked. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh. All you did was block. Oh, I just blocked. Okay. Okay. Yeah. So now you can go. Yeah, yeah. Um... The barbarian will have to shoot at the little guy in the you gotta front. Use, you got to use your uh, my crossbow. You can't. It's adjacent. Oh, spirit blade. Yes. Okay. Well, I'm confused because we have three A and four A. Is it undead? No. No. So three. Un dice. Undead, honey. Or yeah. Zombie. Remember zombies, skeletons. Okay. Uh, and uh, mummies. So I know. I, I know. I probably should know this, guys. I just forget sometimes. Wow, you haven't played it in a while. Only one hit. Only one hit. Yeah. Okay. And you're attacking the goblin. The yeah. goblin gets one defense die. Okay. He did not block it. Woo. Okay. And then the uh, rogue can rogue. attack the orc. Yeah, that's what she's going to do. Go ahead. She gets that three crossbow. Then. Three. Okay. Let's go. Okay. Oh. Only one. Yeah. What does your orc get? And the orc gets two uh, defense. Did not block it. Yes. Now, here's the interesting thing. Yeah. Let's take a look at your your abilities again. Okay. Because we're getting used to this character. This is the first time we're using it. We have right now, right here or now, we haven't played with this character before. So, once per turn, you may throw an extra combat die when attacking a monster next to another hero. So, that means even with the crossbow, you may throw an extra... So, you could have rolled four there. So, she has to be next to the other hero, or the monster has to be? The monster has to be. Okay. That mon so, we should have thrown an extra one right there. So, every time you attack a monster next to another hero, yeah. you get to throw an extra die. All right. And you weren't attacking with the short sword or dagger, so you didn't you didn't get an extra uh, attack there. All right. So this is you know it's getting a little used to here. So you should have rolled four, but you killed them anyway. I did. That's why I wanted to check that because it didn't specify what weapon you need to use. It just says your next attack. Right. On, on your I attack. appreciate that, sweetie. All right. So the goblin steps up. You can do your goblin noise. Wait, 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 wait. Okay. So the goblin has two attacks. Hit you once. And the you barbarian? get seven with the barbarian, yeah. Four, five, six, seven. Ooh, I blocked you. Okay. All right, go ahead, barbarian. Jesus, three sword, three dice. 
My only one hit again. I got it. Oh, I got you though. <laughs> this is why you're playing with two characters. So. <laughs> All right, roll for the rogue. The rogue can go in. All right. Six. Okay, you step in. What do you say? Traps. No. All right, then take her all the way to the... Okay, you don't have to search this room separately. That's fine, but take her to the, the, the well, magic you both, chest. Well, you both can go in. Okay, um, you're just, you're there's just... no traps, so the barbarian's going to search. Okay, hi, you got to draw a card. <laughs> now, this has more cards than the normal deck, because we have cards from Frozen Horror in there. Why didn't we take them out? No, it's okay. We'll, we're not going to do that. We're going to play with everything. That means I'm going to get Wandering Monsters. They're already in there. There's oh. actually more positive things in here now. Oh, good, good, good. And like, hang on. And like, and what we're going to do is, uh, we're going to keep out any negatives until she, Julie gets a positive. So you did get a negative. So that's going to stay out. Even though it says to reshuffle it in, we won't reshuffle it in until okay. Julie finds something good. Uh, so uh, the Wandering Monster in this case is an orc, so it's no big deal. But I wanted gold. I wanted something fun. I know. So now the orc is going to attack you. All right. And the orc gets uh, three attack dice. You're hitting my barbarian, right? Right. Yeah. One hit. Oh. Yeah, we needed all those dice. I know. Okay, now the rogue can go. So you're going to get four dice with your crossbow. Oh, because she's standing next to a... The orc standing next to the barbarian. Uh, two hits. Okay. Uh, hang on a second. I've got to okay. adjust my shirt here. Two defense. I did not block it. I'm rolling really terrible. No, you're rolling really good for me. All right, so that room is taken care of. Okay. What else are you going to do? Barbarian will go into the other room and... Okay, you step in. What do you do? Traps? No. Secret doors? Oh, yeah, I have to wait for the other... My friend to ask for that. No secret doors. Okay, then Barbarian will go search the, the table. Okay, yes. You need to be searching. I know. For this quest. So I here know. we go. Oh, I don't have to draw a card? No. Oh, okay. The first hero to search for treasure finds a small faded note in a drawer of the desk. Read the text that follows to the players. Okay, here we go. Okay. The talisman has aided my work. I see more clearly now what must be done to defeat Zargon and his minions. I must dare to master the dreadcraft upon which the evil sorcerer's power so depends. I'm a Zargon. I'm Zargon. It is Zargon. Okay. And uh, so he, the, tal the talisman he's referring to is the one that you found. So the talisman is a piece of paper? You're wearing it. Oh, I'm wearing it. What does it say? Craw uh, spirit blade? Oh, there say? it is. Talisman of lore. Yeah. That's what, that's, that used to belong to Melar. Oh. Okay, so you're getting a little bit more of the piece of the puzzle. So okay. Uh, so he's he was using the talisman to do his work. Gotcha. All right, where do you want to go? Let's try this door first. Okay, this door. Yeah. I'll have to roll my dice. Four. Okay. You open the door. She puts the toe out. Okay. Well, first off, you don't see anything. Okay, are there any traps, though? Well, why don't you let me set it up first? Oh, sorry. <laughs> because you may not want to search. You may see a monster. Oh, gosh, that's right. So it's blocked okay. off there. So you right. can't, uh, you want to search for traps? Yeah. No traps. All right, we're going to go to the store. Okay, so one, two, three, four. Roll for the rogue. Okay. Eight. Okay, you're at the door. Okay, next turn. Barbarian's going to open it up. Okay. Two. You have two movement points. Okay, what's in there now? Uh, let me move the camera here a little bit. Okay. Zoom in. Da, da, da. I love how the dungeon has light coming into it. Yes, it <laughs> does. Uh, there are some skeletons, so now you're going to get plus attack. Oh, okay, good. Because they're undead. Yeah. So there are three skeletons. Okay. But I have to get close to them with my spirit blade, don't I? Right, so you can just yeah. your crossbow for now. Okay. So here they are. Okay. Go ahead and fire that's your it? crossbow. That's all that's there? Yeah. All right. No doors. Okay, so crossbow will shoot at uh, this guy first, babe. That guy. Sure. Okay. That's good that way. Three. It, it cannot block that. Okay. That dice. So I'll put out the card here. Yeah, that guy's dead. Yeah. It only has one body point. I knocked him down for you. 
Okay, now my rogue will shoot at that guy. Okay. You get, uh, it's not standing next to him, so that's why you only get two. But you didn't remember to get a fourth one anyway. I just thought I'd tell you that it would have been four if the skeleton was next to the barbarian. I did not block it. Okay, the barbarian will no, go. No, it's my turn. Oh, yeah, it's right. You go now. Okay, the skeleton goes here. Yep. And the skeleton has uh, uh, burning hands. No, they don't. Okay, I hit you once. And I blocked you once. Okay, but around the corner. Oh, should be DBs. There was an orc oh, coming poop. up from around the corner you didn't know about. Are you being serious? Yeah, I'm serious. Ah, oh, doggone it, Jim. So it comes around the corner and it okay. attacks you. Oh, darn it. So we have the orc now. Yeah. Three attack dice. So here we go. Okay. Two, uh, one hit. And two blocks. All right. So go ahead and do the... Uh, Barbarian's going to hit the, the... I would hit the orc. Orc with uh, the three. Yeah, three dice because you're using your sword. Oh, shoot. I only got one hit. That oh, stinks. You might get it. No. We blocked it. Pretty. Rogue can get the uh, skeleton. Yeah. You roll four dice. Uh, two hits. You blocked one. The man is dead. Okay. All right, the orc goes. Yeah. Orc gets three attack. Hits you once. And I blocked you once. Okay, go ahead, uh, My turn. barbarian. Three dice. Yes. Yeah. Oh, shoot. Uh-oh. I dropped the die. Darn it. It's okay. Oh, you I blocked, blocked it. it. Now, the rogue... Yeah. You can go, you can move through now. Yeah, you, yeah. You can use your ability. So roll two red dice. Oh, okay. So you get behind it. So this is what's cool about having this character. And why I wasn't afraid to give you just uh, uh, two characters for this quest. All right, roll, roll, uh, it's standing next to yeah. the orc. So this is what you can do, watch. Okay. You roll your short sword, and yeah. then you're going to roll your dagger, but Ooh. then you get plus one die, so you can give it to your short sword first if you want. Okay. One hit. I did not block it's dead. Oh, okay, good. So there you go. Look how you were able that to That was pretty cool. I like that. The rogue is nice. Yeah. You can't wear metal armor, but at least you can move around. But you did come around the corner here. Yeah. What's down there? Uh, it goes around the corner. That's it. No doors, huh? You haven't gone into this room yet. And uh, it does go this way. And you haven't gone up here yet either. That's true. So which way do you want to go? All right. Let's let's um, let's try this room. Let's put a toe in. All right. Okay, what do you do? Traps? No. Okay, let's Rogue get my lady in. She has secret doors? No. Well, damn. Uh, treasure? Okay, let's draw from the card. Gold! Okay. Yes! Okay, it's only uh, 25 gold, though. I don't have a pencil. I, I gotta give you one. That's okay. So, you got something positive, which means I reset the deck now. Okay. And I give that to the barbarian, yes? Yeah, that's fine. Okay. 25. Thank you for the pencil, sweetie. Sure. So, now I'm gonna shuffle everything back in. Okay. Now, some people are like, well, you're supposed to reshuffle every time. It makes it no fun if you're always drawing bad things. And you see me draw like wandering monster after wandering monster. Yeah. I get very frustrated. So there we go. Okay, we're gonna go out of the room and we'll go cruise down the hallway. Okay, you can now just get to where you need to go here because okay. save time here. There is it is blocked off. Oh no, where? It is blocked off here. Oh. There are two doors. All right, cool beans, and then we'll go check out the doors. A door here. Okay. And a door here. Okay. Which one do you want to go to? We'll try the first room first, please. Okay. Five. Five. So it opens. Yeah. You see a torture. Oh, to gosh, you. no. Yeah. That's not good. And there is a zombie in here. Uh, there's nothing for me to read. I gotta look at my little cheat sheet. Let me go over here. There you are. You 
open that door. Yeah. Well, Barbarian can't see her. He's, she's going to have to step in. Uh, the rogue can, but you can... Would you roll for movement? Uh, five. Well, you can step in, but it could be traps. What no, I don't do? want to do that. Then just have the rogue fire. Okay. You only get three dice because yeah, the thing's not, not, not standing next. So you uh, got one, one hit. hit. Mm -hmm. All right, so zombies. Let me find the card. Get three defense. Oh, boy. A little tougher than skeletons. Yeah, they are. Gosh. And they blocked it. it. All right, so the zombie moves five. Darn it. It gets right there. Okay. And you get two attack dice. Two attack dice. Hit you once. Oh, yeah, oh, you did. phew. You did block it. Yeah, I thought I didn't. Just barely. Barely. Okay, so go ahead and uh, roll for the barbarian. Now, I do crossbow. Yeah, three. No, you do You do your, your sword. Like you get four blade. dice. Okay. Oh, good. I got two hits. Okay. And they get three hits. Yes. Okay. That was a good, good thing to hit you with. Yep. All right, so the rogue can go in. All right. Oh, we got both dice. Okay. Traps? No. All right, well, we'll, she'll go in and search the, we'll go in and search the, um, wait, 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 before we search, are there secret doors? Yes. Yes. Oh, yes, you're remembering your questions. That's yep. good. I haven't had it to remind you. Nope. All right, so there is a secret door, but you haven't searched for it. You haven't searched for treasure if you want to. You said I have to search a lot, yes? Fine. Barbarian will search. You just search a lot anyways. This mm -hmm. is an easier quest. But Barbarian will search. All right, well, so let me shuffle these up. I thought you just did. I'm going to shuffle Ooh, what is that? Is that something oh, good? Oh, that was a trap, a hazard. Oh, thank goodness. Yeah, put it way at the bottom. Way at the bottom. <laughs> it's actually a lot of hazards. Oh, boogers. Uh, you know, let me brighten this up a little bit. There we go, it's a little brighter. Yeah. Okay. Okay. You go. guys ready? Yeah. Heroic brew. Ooh. All right, so this is why you do it, because you can find these potions. Yes. Okay. It contains, uh, before you attack, you can make two attacks instead of one. This may only be used once. So let me write that down for you. We'll get that to the barbarian? Yeah, I would. Okay. So that's a positive, so I'm going to reshuffle the deck now. Well, you don't write down what it is. I remember. Oh. It's okay. <laughs> so heroic brew. Right here. Brew times two attack. There we go. All right. And then it goes right here. Yep. So you save that for when you're in a real tough room. Definitely. All right, we're going to go to the secret door now. Okay, so you're there. Yeah. But the rogue has to be behind. Okay. Six for the Six. barbarian. So you open it. Yeah, what's in there? A mummy, skeleton, and zombie. No, what's what's my whole thing again? I'm going for a tower or a maze or I'm, you're I'm trying confused. to find his library. Find his library. And then you're making your way through the maze. Okay. Make sure you get to his laboratory and then get to the tower. You're just trying to find out what's going on. So is it a laboratory I'm going to or a library? Both. Both. A library, a laboratory, and a tower. They're all connected. But I haven't hit any of those yet, right? Nope. No. Okay. So they're in probably one of these groups of well, rooms. You're not in the tower yet. You're in his maze. Oh, I'm the, so in the maze. maze. You get to the tower through the maze. Gotcha. Okay, what do you want to uh, hit here? The um, mummy. You can fire your crossbow. Yeah, yeah. Uh, one hit. Well, you can't kill uh, mummies with one hit. No, I can't. So. Darn it. Let me get out the cards here. Okay. You got it. Oh, I'm zombie. sorry, sweetie. I just wanted you to see what I had. You're fine, Julie. <laughs> Mummy. Ba -da -da, ba -da -da, ba -da -da. Oh, it's a great movie. Okay, so four defense. Oh my gosh. And two body points. Yeah, you're going to block it. Yep. I did. Poo. Okay, so the rogue can't fire through unless you want to step in, but you get attacked no, by two I different No, I don't want to do that. No, no. Okay, I wouldn't either. 
That's smart. Okay, here comes the mummy. Okay, I got my dice. And Bring it. And for three. Two hits. Three blocks. You're okay. Go ahead. You get four dice now because it's undead. Okay. Woo! -hoo! Three hits. Ah. Uh. Unbox one is dead. Yes. Okay, so you got the zombie. I mean the mummy. Yes. Okay, now the rogue. Yeah, yeah. Might want to go in. They're not too tough. Um, okay. But there could be a trap. There could be a trap though. No, I'm going to wait. Okay. I'm going to wait. All right. So the zombie is going to hit the barbarian. Yep. Does that kind of make you paranoid? Mm-hmm. Uh, missed. Okay, go ahead. Uh, you get four attacks against the zombie. Two hits. Zombie gets three defense. Uh, Black horn, but it's dead. Yes. Okay, bring on the next guy and kick his ass. Okay. Well, you could have the rogue go in there and take a chance. No, because there could be a trap. Well, the, the whole point is, though, somebody's got to go in there. Mm. Fine. Okay, so you use your, you move in there and you can... Do I have uh, to roll the dice? It doesn't matter what you roll. You okay. only need two movement. Okay. There, there is no trap and you can... Good. Now if you go adjacent, well you can fire with your crossbow. Well let me, th yeah, because the monster's not adjacent to anybody. So just use your crossbow. Oh, so just three dice. Okay. Yeah. Oh darn, one hit. I didn't block it. They're dead. Okay, so there is the chest. What do you do? You said there are no traps, so she, uh, she'll go in and search. Okay. Doesn't say anything is in the tra the chest, so you got to draw a card. Okay. Well, how, who do you want to have search? The barbarian. Barbarian. Yeah, so you better have the barbarian go in here. Doesn't matter. You get in there. Oh, okay. There's no time limit in this room. Okay. Okay. Get something good. Get something good. Okay, go ahead. Ooh, a potion of strength. Strength. Yes. So you're getting your potions back because you're searching. Cause you used a lot in the last yeah, quest. Yeah, I did. What does it do for me, though? Okay, enabling, enabling you to roll two extra combat dice the next time you attack. Do not return this card to the deck. Well, I'm doing it differently. Okay. Okay. So you got... Potion of strength. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, plus two A. That's all. That means plus two attack. Dice. Okay. Yeah. All righty then. Oh, I have to, I gotta move it up. There we go. I guess we should keep it we up. We should keep it up. Yeah. It says keep it up. No, we should because it makes it too easy. Exactly. So let me take out the other one you found. You found gold. Yes. And you found what? A wandering monster. No, those we, we put back in. Oh, okay. Uh, potion of strength, heroic brew. Okay, stop now. Okay. And that's all I need to know. Okay. Heroic brew. Yes. My point is, is that I keep them out. I keep, I, I keep out the positives because you shouldn't be able to find tons of... No, I agree. Things. I agree. But if you find something negative, it should stay out until you find something mm -hmm. positive. That's what we'll do. Well, since we're in the room and we did our thing, the uh, what's your, rogue wants to know, is there a secret door? No. All right, we're out of here. Okay, you want to go to this door? Yeah. Please. Okay, so you're right here. Okay, I'll roll the dice. Oh, gosh darn, I'm just rolling ones left and right here. That's what happens when you have a heavy, heavy uh, armor on. <clears throat> it's okay. in there for us to deal with. There, oh, another door. Cool. And there is a cupboard. Oh, okay. Right there, let me move the camera. Is that where they put their clothes or their food? Well, there's a bunch of coats in the cupboard. And it's cold. You walk into it and it takes you to a, a land that's snowy. Ooh. 
You know what that is? Mm-mm. The Lion, the Witch, and the Wardrobe. Oh. All right. So you open it. Mm -hmm. There are no monsters. All right. Well, she'll put a toe in. I'm going to re-roll. Oh, yeah. She got a one, so she can go in. Yeah, she went in. Um, All right. So this is what I'm going to read to you. This room feels strangely familiar to you. You glance at the cupboard. It's almost as though you remember being here before. Perhaps when last you adventured to Miller's Maze. You open the cupboard and pull a bottle from many that clutter the shelf. Uh, it is a potion of healing that restores up to two lost body points when consumed. So you didn't even have to search. Nice. It just says read it and uh, it, you get it. Cool beans. So I guess you're going to have another one. Nice. So I'll say times two here. Okay. okay. That was good. Yeah, you just had to find the room. Yeah. So. Was that the library? No. No. It's just a sort of cupboard. It's a cupboard. Okay. So let me adjust that there. Oh, I'm going to move my hands out of your way, sweetie. Okay. Keep on finding things to write on. Okay. Uh, okay, so you, you haven't done anything else yet. I asked if there were traps. Uh, oh, so you walk in and traps? No traps. Secret doors? Yes. Okay. In fact, i got to shift this up. Ooh. Secret door right here. Okay. Good things happen in secret doors. Usually, but if Usually. I design an adventure, it won't be. Well, you didn't uh, design this adventure. No. So we're going to try the secret door because it's always a good thing. Okay. Go ahead and uh, roll Six. movement. Six. So you're going to have a lot of movement. Yeah. All right, so let me show you what's going on. There's a door okay. here. Ooh, okay. Uh, it's blocked off here. Ah. Oh. And here. Okay. And there is uh, two orcs. Yeah, no big deal. In the hallway or in the... In the hallway. In the hallway. Hmm. Okay. So you can fire your crossbow at the guy. Okay. Uh, right here. Yeah, I want to do that one. Three hits. Can't block it. Okay, now you can have the rogue step in if you want. Yeah. You step in there. Is there a trap? No. But you can roll two dice and one die. Okay. Two dice for the short sword, and one die for the dagger. Okay. And I did not block it. Because I think, I th do they get two or one? I always forget these little things. They get two defense. All right. Ooh, so you, uh, go to me... that door. All right, uh, you haven't asked your questions. Oh, is there traps? No. Is there secret doors? No. There's not gonna be treasure in the hallway, so let's just go to the other room. You're right. Oh, this is your dice. <gasps> Sorry, honey. It's okay. Okay, we're going to open up that door. Woo! Five. All right, there is another door in here. Oh, hot dog. And there's a table. A table? All right. That means there could be some good treasure. Probably not with a table. Oh. It's just a table. <laughs> and there's a goblin. That's it? That's it. Well, it should, she'll arrow the goblin. I'll lay down the, uh, so they can see. She's going to arrow the goblin. Okay, do the crossbow. Go ahead. Yeah, You're I can't toast. block that. That's gone. All right, now uh, you can go in. The rogue, let's see if there's any traps. Okay, no traps. Okay. Anything um, else you're going to ask? Secret doors? No. Treasure? Uh, got to draw. Go ahead. Ooh Potion of healing. Yes. This is one of this is one of the good ones. So we'll write that down. That's what my robe gets. Uh, I already have two, so I get one more. No, it's not that one. It's a one die, six red die. I don't this understand. Is, you roll a, a, a red die. See how much it heals. So it can heal one to six. So this is the best one. Okay. Potion of healing. Of uh, healing. Mm -hmm. One D six. You've gotten these before. You used them up. Oh. Okay. Okay. Well, oh, um, they have them. Sorry. It's okay. You didn't hurt me. We'll cruise over to this other door, honey. Okay. Yep. Yeah. But I want my barbarian to be first. All right. Thank you. So you can open the door. 
Mm-hmm. Okay. Uh, there are an orc and a goblin. All right, so fire your. Uh, at the go at the orc. Yeah, I would. Yeah. Three dice. Oh, boogers. Blocked it. Ooh. What's the rogue gonna do? She's gonna chill. Okay. Actually, could she move to this part right here and shoot that guy? If she moved to that square, could she no. shoot that guy? So you'd be blocking line of sight. Ah, uh, okay. Okay, goblin steps forward. Uh, actually, with two, two hits. Ooh. And oh goodness! Yeah, she took a hit. I took oh my a gosh! Hit. Oh my gosh! Darn it, Jim. Okay. Uh, you get to go, barbarian. Okay, dead. Rogue can go in. Step one, no trap. We well, went here. That's all you need to do. Oh, okay. Fire your crossbow. Oh, shoot. Uh oh, orcs attacking the rogue. Here we go. You don't have as much defense. And I hit you once. I get three defense. Yes, because you have the bracers and your natural defense. Yes. You blocked it. Now the barbarian, well, she can move first. So roll for the, uh, well, the barbarian goes first in order. Uh, you can attack with your crossbow. Two hits. You no blocked matter. it. I only have one body point. Okay. So you're in there. What do you do? Traps? No. Secret doors? No. Then we'll go to the next door. Okay. I always want to be on the angles. Oh. Get the diagonal. Okay. Uh, so you're opening this up. Four. There's a door here. Oh my gosh. And a door here. Uh oh. And a weapon rack. Ooh, that could be good. And a gargoyle. Oh, jeepers. So you actually have a tough monster for once. Son of a gun. Let me zoom in there a little bit. Okay. Oops, a little too far. <laughs> well, my barbarian will shoot at the gargoyle with her crossbow. Yeah, let me just read it, see if there's anything to read here. Okay. I mess with the camera too much. All right. Uh, nothing to read. And I got to get out the card. I haven't, we haven't played with the gargoyle. How do I know time. when I'm going to be in the library and when I'm going to be in the laboratory? We haven't found it yet. <sighs> okay, just fine. so you know, you haven't found it yet. Fine, fine, fine. All right, go ahead. Attack with your crossbow. Two hits. Two hits. Yep. Four, five defense. Oh, goodness. Locked it. Pooey. I don't know if you want the road to No, I do not. Could she not shoot him from there? No. No? Okay. Next turn you can. Okay. Gargoyle, ste gargoyle steps up. All right, I got my dice ready. Four attack. Two, three hits. Uh oh. One, two. Yeah, you blocked it. Okay, go ahead, barbarian. You get three dice. Yeah. Oh, sorry, honey. I didn't mean to do that. One hit. Well, that's pretty weak. I know. Got weak rolling there. I know. But you didn't block it. Okay, but it's still alive. Now use a crossbow yeah. again for the. Uh, yes, yeah, so and you get roll. four dice. Four dice. Because you're standing next to a hero. Oh, shoot. All right, two hits. Well, you might get it. Yes. yes. Score. Sorry, yeah. I keep slipping off my pillow. <laughs> All right, so uh, what do you do now? Well, we'll put a toe in. Any other traps? No. All right. Then we're going to go over to the weapon rack. And I won't... Barbarian will search the weapon rack. Okay. There you go. Draw. Potion of warmth. Huh. You keep on getting lucky. For all those times when you didn't want to search, you're getting lucky. Okay. Drink the potion immediately after suffering damage from ice storm or chill spells. Uh, it's not going to help you. There's no going to be no ice storm or chill spells in this adventure. Oh, 
Okay. But it will restore one lost body point in other ways. So you might as well give it to the... Uh, the rogue? Yeah. Okay. I trust you on that one. Okay, potion of warmth. Let's put it up here. Uh, plus one BP. So no weapons, huh? No, I mean, you pretty much max out anything. But it's good that you are searching because what if there's an artifact there? You've missed artifacts in previous adventures because you weren't searching. Yeah. All right. Um, well, since this will go to a room, and that's my chance of maybe getting a library, we're going to go to this door because this just goes to a hallway. Okay. Two. Looking here, there is a, a chest. Ooh! The chest has been open. I can move them. That's it. That's it. Yeah, that's it. All right. Well, she's gonna put a toe in. Are there traps? Yes. Ah, oh, good night. But you can get around it. Oh, okay. So you want to search the room? Yeah. Oh, well. Barbarian will search. Okay, draw. There's nothing in the chest. Potion of warmth. Yeah. There's two of these. So people don't think I'm I'm being goofy. There are two of them, and you found the other one. So I'll put times two here. Okay. Might as well give it to both of them to the rogue. Sure. Talk about getting lucky. And then the rogue wants to know: Are there secret doors? No. No, no secret doors. So we're gonna have to come back out. Still have a door in the hallway. Yeah, I know. We're gonna come over to the hallway door. See what right. what's there. You open it. Let's move this stuff, please. I'll take care of it. Okay. Just, just get out of the way. Thank you. Okay. Uh, <laughs> I'm just letting you know. You, don't, you, you won't be able to... You find the door out, but you haven't found the library yet. Oh, so okay. So you know you need to go there. That's where I go out. Okay. Okay. Yeah. That's blocked off. And it's blocked off here, too. All right, well, then we're going to have to go back around. Put us at that door there. Okay. Yeah. I had it upside down. <laughs> Cupboard's upside down. <laughs> All right. Open the door. What do I see? Let me uh, set it up for you. Okay. Actually, I better take off the camera. I'm going to be moving it a lot. <laughs> we don't make you guys sick. So I'm going to unzoom. I got to be getting close to this stuff. Oh, there's only so many rooms left. Exactly. So. I mean, you had to go that way anyway. True. So I know how to get out. Because that's the way out. Right. Because you're getting through his maze. All right. Uh, so you're right here. Mm hmm. You yep. open it up, yep. you see a quarter this way and this way. No doors. No doors, huh? No. Okay, let's try it. Oop, excuse me, sweetie. We'll go this way. All right, move your guys. Is there a trap? You step out. Yeah, there's a trap. Oh, of Not where you step, though. Oh, okay, good. Uh, you can see it right here. Oh, we're not going to go that way, then. Okay. So one, two... All right, just let me move your guys. Oh, okay. Just to save time. There's no other traps. Oh, okay, good. Uh, oh, there's something else you can ask. Are there any secret doors? No. Mm -hmm. Ha. I Made you ask anyway. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Uh, there is a door all the way over here. All right. We'll go to that door. Dang. All right. Let's try this door. Hey, do you notice it's the center of the... Uh, yep. And guess where the library is? In the center of the room. In the center. Is a laboratory in there too? Do they share the same space? The laboratory is not in this adventure. I thought I'd just search for both. You'll find the laboratory in a future adventure. So I just needed the library this time. Correct. Okay, good. So you open it. Yep. And you'll see, hey, there's two bookshelves. Woohoo! We can go read. That's why, surprise, surprise, there's a library and there's bookshelves. Yeah. <laughs> well, it could be a different kind. It could be a game library with calyxes. Um, Those are types of bookshelves. Okay, thank you. That's what a lot of gamers have. Those are oh, those okay. square bookshelves. Oh, yeah, I like those. And there's a, uh, an altar with a book on it. 
<laughs> Maratu, Ritu. <laughs> uh, <laughs> it was an orc. Orc card, orc S smart. Or anything, or ab- like yeah. that. Shop smart. Oh, yeah. Shop smart. smart. Shop, Shop S smart. smart. And <laughs> a goblin. Okay. So, not to. Uh, I mean, you found the library. Okay, first she's going the barbarian's gonna shoot at this little dude. You don't want to shoot the abomination? She can't see. Look, she's right here. She can't see that way, can she? Uh yeah, you could actually. All right, then she'll shoot the abomination. You ready? Yeah. Okay. Three hits. Three hits. He's dead. Probably not, but it's No, good. that's Probably, that's basically what you need if I don't defend against it. So here's the abomination. Okay. Yep. It's got oh two body points, but only three defense. I got you, I got you. Yeah, I'm gone. Okay. And then the rogue, which the rogue is gonna say uh the rogue can't attack anything. Okay, she's staying there. Okay, the goblin steps up. <laughs> and the goblin has to attack. It's a one. And I didn't block it. What the deuce? Wow. It's a pretty crummy roll. That was a very crummy roll. The barbarian actually got, took two hits this adventure. Shoot. All right, here goes the uh, goblin. You just did the goblin. You just did your goblin Oh, voice. you're right. Go ahead, barbarian. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See, you're trying to do it again. Yeah, you're right. I was. Shoot your pants. One, two. Two? Two. Goblin has one defense. Oh, uh-huh. it's dead. Can't do anything. Now the roll can go in. And fire your crossbow. Let's do it. Okay. Go ahead. She's stepping. No traps. Now fire your crossbow. Now try to roll over here. Okay. There you go. You got one hit. Two defense. Didn't block it. Wow, he dies at one? Yeah. All of them do except abominations and gargoyles Baby. and mummies. All right. Well, are there any traps? No. And I'll read to you what's in here. So okay. here we go. Oh, I didn't even have to search. No, you, you do. Read to me. You do search. Oh. Okay, the first hero to search for treasure finds a journal hidden behind some larger books. This is a journal of Melar. My experiments proceed well. I have been able to summon the dead. Now I must prepare for summoning a... The journal is protected by a spell and bursts into flames. Oh, shooby doobies. So who was reading it? The druid... Or, no, the rogue. She's the only okay. one in there. Well, that's fine. You could have had the barbarian read it, but the, it bursts into flames, and the rogue takes one damage. God, poo. First time the rogue has been hit. Darn it, Jim. And that's it. I mean, you could go this way, but you did find what you need to find. Oh, okay, good. Unless you want to keep on searching. No. Okay. Unless you go back, whee, and you go out the door. Yay. And the only thing that you missed was actually nothing. If you look at how I'll show you what you missed here. Ready? Mm-hmm. Uh, oops. <coughs> you missed a, a room there with a trap. Oh, thank goodness. Oh, wait, uh, and there is... Uh, Oh, you already got to that room. Yeah. So that's it. Room with a trap. Yay! So you got through it. Now you do get to get your hit points back between oh, that's adventures. Right. Now with this particular quest book, mm-hmm. it says that you cannot go to the alchemist or to the armorer unless you're allowed to. So you cannot buy any, even if you wanted to, you couldn't buy any more potions or you couldn't, oh, you couldn't buy thank armor you for or things like that. that. that okay. In fact, I'm looking ahead here. Okay. I'm just trying to see when you get to do that. Maybe the last one? Yeah, I'm not sure. So I'm going to have to keep searching to make sure I get a lot of those then, right? Well, the point is you're not going to uh, be able to buy anything for a while, but you do heal. Okay. Interesting. Okay. Well, there you go. So that's the first uh, quest in Prophecy of Talor. 
That was fun. Yeah. That was a lot of fun. I, I let my girls did good. I was looking for a box there. There's no box. There's no box. <laughs> so we'll be playing the other ones. There's another 12 more to go. Oh I think I said there's 13, gosh. right? So strap in, guys yeah. and girls. Right. We're going to do this again soon. All right. So thanks for watching. Thanks so much for watching. Please don't forget to like and subscribe. We really appreciate it. And we'll see you next time. All right. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.